Hey guys, it's me Caden and welcome back to the channel where we are back yet again with another review video and in today's review we're going to be taking a look at the Jack Pacific Metal Sonic action figure. So I was hunting for some new Sonic figures and I happened to come across this one. So um, I have seen uh, Metal Sonic before but I wasn't able to get him then but I was able to get him now so uh, yeah. Uh, now I finally have this guy for my collection. And uh, this is the re-released version of Metal Sonic. Um, I know he was released before, but I wasn't able to get him then either. But uh, yeah, so I finally got my hands on him. And this is from the most uh, recent wave of Sonic action figures. So uh, yeah, but without further ado, let's go ahead and get straight into it. So here is the Jack Pacific Metal Sonic action figure. See right there. The beautiful packaging. It does have a few dents, you know, right there and there, but I mean, oh, whatever. I mean, he's still, you know, uh, the packaging is still, uh, I guess, besides that, in good condition. <laughs> Anyways, but yeah, uh, here he is. See him on the front of the box right there. It does come with the accessory. Yep, has Eggman's face on it. And yeah, see, in front of the box, you got the Sonic the Hedgehog logo, modern Sonic the Hedgehog logo. And it says Metal Sonic right there, and the Jack Specific logo on the bottom corner. And uh, yeah, you got Modern Sonic right there, and you got the ring around. I've always loved uh, this style packaging, it looks really cool. And uh, yeah, here's the side of the box, the other side, and then uh, here we go to the back of the box. You can see you know, all the points of articulation, 13 points of articulation. And yeah, it shows what the figure is supposed to look like. And then you see all the other figures that you could collect in this wave. You got Infinite. I did see Infinite, but you know, I just, I really wanted Metal Sonic, so I got Metal Sonic, especially because I don't have him, I didn't have him yet. Um, but yeah, and you got Cream the Rabbit right there. That's, you know, pretty nice that they finally gave her a figure. And then you have Sonic re released again, but this time uh, the only difference is that he comes with a new accessory, a skateboard. Yeah, pretty cool. You know, I've got all the general information on the back too. So, yep, uh, that is the box. And uh, let's go ahead and get this guy open. Alright. It's a shame to take these figures out of the box. I will keep them in the box, but, you know, I like to have them for display. So, yeah. Alright. Get him from his chamber. I gotta move all that stuff out of the way. Alright, so go ahead. Start with the leg. Okay, push the leg out. Oh my god, did his hand just fall off? Um, I hope that could go back on. Um, alright, uh, I'm not gonna be too concerned about that just yet. Uh, uh, there we go. You could see right there that his hand fell off. Poor guy, couldn't even get unpackaged, unpackaged right. Um. Anyways, all right. So let's go ahead and take out the accessory. Oh my god, it's brutal. All right. So here is. Oh, what the? His other? Did his other hand stay inside of the? Oh my goodness, thing. Good thing I noticed that. Okay, so let's go ahead and put his hands back on. Uh, it's a good thing that you can put them on. Yeah, I could see that it has the ball joints. So that's cool. So you don't have to worry about breaking this guy. So yeah, hurt it here first. So if his hands come off, you can't put them back on. So yeah, all right, so here he is in all of his glory out of the packaging. And yeah, uh, this figure looks Really nice. Um, he looks really accurate to how he is in the games. And yeah, you know, Metal Sonic is one of the original and, you know, more known Sonic villains. And uh, yeah, they did a great job with him. Uh, Jax, <laughs> yeah, looking pretty good here. So there is his face right there. The head sculpt is amazing. You know, I like the spikes. Uh, nice and sharp, like how they should be. And yeah, he got his ears, he got his red eyes. The paint job is also nice as well. I don't really see any um, mess ups here or there. 
at least uh, not any major ones. And yeah, and, and they did a great job on his eyes. See, he got his classic red eyes. Looks real menacing. And yeah, he got his nose. See the details of the rivets on the you know, side of his snout and on his you know, arms and stuff, his legs. Uh, you got his belly right there. Did a great job on that as well. Here are his fingers. Both of them. So, yeah. Nice paint job there too as well. And then see his shoes. Let's see, yep. Got all the details there. The red shoes with the white stripes. And here's the back of this figure. Back of him, you can see the motor right there, and you just got the you know the Jack's logo uh, molded on the back, so that's cool. So yeah, and as for articulation, uh, this guy, let's see, yes, 360 head movement, move his head all around, his arms, and his arms. I think. Can you move this part? I don't. Yeah, I, I don't know if you can. But yeah, you can move his hands all around. 360 movement right there. And you can take them off and put them back on. Um, so that's good that they did that. So you won't be able to break him as easily. And uh, as for his legs, they do kick uh, about right there, back. And then fourth. Yeah, it's the best you're going to get. Or, let me see. I think I have it the wrong way. Yeah. Oh no, yeah, you could kick like that. So it goes forward about there. And then let's try this again. Back. About right there. So yeah. So the articulation is pretty, pretty great on this figure. And uh, yeah, you know, it's that dark blue color. Got that right as well. And uh, yeah, this is a really great uh, Metal Sonic figure. Um, he isn't shiny, but you know, it's still pretty accurate. So yeah, let's put him right there. And then here's the accessory he comes with. I don't know if you can hold this or what this, oh, what, can you open? No, just, you just press it down. I feel like I should know what this is, but it's kind of, I don't know, it's just the accessory he comes with. And you can see Dr. Robotnik's malicious face on there. So uh, yeah, let's go ahead and compare him to his uh, mini variant. So there's the two Metal Sonics together. Definitely way better than the smaller figure. So uh, yeah. Uh, one thing that's like a lot better is the eyes. Because you see the eyes on this figure. You know, if you're looking at it, like at that angle, it looks good. But you could tell, yeah. It doesn't go all the way up. Like his eye ridge. But like, you know, this one. Like the regular version, yeah. It's a lot better. So I do like how they uh, fix that. I rate this fig a 10 out of 10. Which is pretty usual for these figures, anyways. Anyways, that's gonna be about it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, thank you all so much for 13.1k subscribers. I really appreciate all the love and support. Um, you know, you guys just keep on supporting the channel, and I just, I'm really thankful for it. But yeah, uh, you guys go ahead and have a great rest of your day or night, and I will see you guys next time.